Good morning vlog. How's everyone doing? My name is Paige. I am currently on the Norwegian Star on my fourth cruise ship contract as a singer dancer. And in this vlog, I'm going to take you through the process of installing our very first show, Band on the Run. So I boarded the ship two days ago and I'm still getting adjusted. It's quite a lot different than the cruise ships that I've been working on previously. If you've been subscribed to my channel for a while, you would have seen all of my world cruise vlogs as I was working on Regent Seven Seas, which is a very small luxury cruise line. So this is a very big change for me, a much larger ship. We have 2000 guests, I think, and the most I've ever had is 700. There's new rules, there's new dress codes. It's really exciting and I'm still kind of getting used to this new environment, but I'm so, so grateful to be here. So today we have a very busy day in install. We're in the theater almost all day. We are currently docked in Spain and today we have a technical walk of the stage. So we have a lot of hydraulics and turntables that we use in this show. So we're going to do a safety walk of that this morning and check out all of those pieces. And later we have our first EQ where we finally get to sing on a microphone and do all of the sound technical elements with that. And then later tonight, we have our costume cue to cue. So it's a very busy day, but I'm excited for it. And I thought it'd be a great day to take you along with me to show you all the ins and outs and what actually happens behind the scenes as we finally get to the theater and install our show to open for all the wonderful guests. I also got some Starbucks this morning because our ship has one which is so new to me, but I'm loving it. I'm gonna get dressed into my rehearsal clothes and head to the theater to start my day. the dressing room to get my show shoes. Okay, I secured my show shoes. I will show you the dressing room eventually, but it's just a little bit chaotic as we just boarded the ship and they're trying to get everything organized. But I promise I'll show you soon because it's so beautiful. today. Okay. Wow. <laughs> like a little spider. <laughs> Terry, are we good to go for opening? Can we go to places for top of the show? We're gonna close the mid curtain. Okay, we're gonna take it from the top of the show and then we're gonna stop until you guys all travel downstage. Yeah. We just did like a cue to cue with those platforms rising, the turntable. Yeah, they call it animation. Yeah, Oh yes, we had a si we had someone seasick yesterday. I now, like, now he's better. He actually grew up on the floor we're standing on right now. <laughs> in this corner. No, no, Jose. Yeah. <laughs> but he's better now. We're docked in port, so we're all good. <laughs> yes, we're doing a full run now, which is exciting. Our first like real full run on the stage. Okay, 
so our rehearsal went a little bit over time. So now we are running to the mess to eat lunch really fast, and then we have our safety test. Coco! You're limping! New Leducas! New Leducas! Blisters! I'm already broken in three pairs. Oh gosh. Hey, Daniel. Hi there. Our vegan lunch for the day. Mm -hmm. We're matching. We are matching. <laughs> So there's 20 lifeboats. Mm -hmm. 20 lifeboats. It's like 14 life rafts with 158 capacity. Seven fire zones, 19 water pictures. Two stations. Two. Oh. <laughs> it's time for the safety test. Oh my gosh, you guys, that was the longest safety test I've ever done. All the Regent ones, it was like one page maybe front and back, like 30 questions, super easy. This was 60 questions long. Oh my gosh, wild, wild. Now I'm running to the theater to vocally warm up to get our mics fitted. <laughs> Station is all clean and organized, looking all beautiful. Here's a first look. Got my mic. Huh? Hello. Bad girl, sad girl, you're such a naughty bad girl. You bad girl, you sad girl, you're such a dirty bad girl. red spotlight <laughs> but we just did our first EQ and sang a bunch of stuff and now we're gonna add in the band which is so exciting I can't wait to hear the show with all of the sound elements hopefully it doesn't take too too long <laughs> hear the full band finally and be able to hear all of our singers amazing voices i am starving so i'm gonna head to the mess and then later tonight we have our costume cue to cue, which is another exciting layer to add to our show to finally see all the costumes we get to wear um, but how it works tonight is that we set out all of our costumes and quick changes and we'll just practice those moments so we won't actually run the full show yeah hopefully all goes well I'm really excited to see how we get to dress. Now I am off to the mess for some food. Hey, so I'm back from dinner. It was really good actually for the mess. I had some yummy rice and a lot of my favorite cooked veggies. So that was a win. I'm now feeling very tired. So I think I'm gonna take a nap. We just sailed away from Spain, so I had a really beautiful view out my porthole window. I mentioned in my previous video, but this is actually a temporary cabin for me. This isn't the one that I'm usually assigned to on this ship. 
there's a bit of a mess up so i'm here for the first cruise only so i'm trying to make the most of it this beautiful window and all this space the sail away was really nice to sit in my windowsill like how big is this this is crazy we have our costume cute cute soon we have to do our hair for it and then we actually just got our schedule for tomorrow and we're doing some of our broadway cabaret work and we're also doing a full run of the show with all of our hair, makeup, costumes, tech, band, everything, everything tomorrow for the first time. So that's really exciting. Yeah, so I just need to rest up so that I can make it through tomorrow as well because I just did a lot of singing and there's more to come. Yeah, so I'm gonna take a nap, but I will see you as I head to the theater for our costume cue to cue. Hey guys, so we're getting all our costumes together and bringing them down backstage to set them up for our quick changes. Okay. We are all done with our costume cue to cue. Sorry I couldn't show you so much of it because it's a really important process and we all need to be very focused and obviously there's people changing so I can't bring out my camera for that. But it went really well. Like we got down so early. I mean, it's still 12.30 a.m. But usually this can last pretty long depending on how intense your show is and the costume changes and things like that. But it went really smooth. There was only a few changes that we had to try a few times to get everything figured out with the order of like unzip this first, then put on this, then take off that. So we got it all sorted out. And it was so fun to see everyone in their costume. It makes me so excited to get on stage and perform these shows in front of an audience. And I really love all the costumes for Band on the Run. They're super cute. I'll definitely show you them when we open the show. Yeah, I'm just feeling really excited. So I'm really looking forward to seeing this theater full of people. This is the biggest theater I've performed on on a ship. My last few contracts were the first few ships back after COVID, so the audience sizes weren't super big. So I'm very excited to look out and see a huge full audience. I cannot wait for that and to have that like little butterfly feeling. It's almost 1 a.m. now, so I really need to get to bed. So I will see you tomorrow for another day of install. Good night. <laughs> It's a sunny day. Woo! I think we're, we're in France. France. Yeah, I was gonna say, I think it's France. <laughs> and we got Starbucks. <laughs> it's so bright. I'm like, I know, I'm squinting. We had our last safety meeting, and now we're having a nice morning. We had a nice yeah. breakfast, a Starbucks, a walk in the sun, yeah. and later we have a full run of our show costumes, lights, music, yeah. everything. Exciting. just been doing my show makeup in my cabin. I am waiting for my eyelash glue to dry. <sighs> yeah, I'm feeling so tired today. I don't know if it's because of how busy install has been, or if it's my jet lag, or if it's both, which is probably both. Yeah, I just find it really hard to fall asleep at night because we end rehearsal so late at like 12, 30, 1 a.m. And then you still have this adrenaline rush from performing the show and being around all your friends and everything. And then to just come here and immediately fall asleep doesn't happen. So <laughs> I'm feeling very tired, uh, but also very excited to see all of the elements come together. Yesterday was of course very PC, like we did a run of the show with just the audio and then we did a run of the show only working on costumes. So today is really the first time that everything is fully coming together. So that's really exciting. And it's been really cool to learn a new show as you know, my last contract, I did that ship twice. So I've been doing the same shows for the past year. So it's been really cool to learn a brand new show, get to see all the elements slowly come together again. It's been really refreshing and exciting. So yeah, I'm really looking forward to today. I'm all finished with my hair. I'm just doing like half up curly. <laughs> Excuse all my luggage everywhere. I still haven't been able to move into my permanent cabin. Hopefully I can do that one of these days soon. So I'm all ready and I'm gonna run to the mess to have lunch really quick and then I'm off to the theater. I just got back from lunch and I just had a little salad. The salads in the crew mess here are actually really good. I'm really enjoying them. They always have beans and chickpeas and lots of different veggies to put in the salad, which I've really been enjoying because on my last regent ship, the salad bar wasn't 
so great. I'm just missing my nutritional yeast, which I need to order to the ship. But otherwise, the food has been not so exciting. Once I've been here a little bit longer, I'm definitely going to make a food review video as a vegan on the ship, what it's like to eat here. I did a whole video on that on my Regent contract, if you want to check that out. But I'm really interested to see how it compares being on NCL. And I have a little bit of time before I have to go to the theater. So I'm just gonna relax and enjoy my porthole window. It's so crazy to me how big this cabin is. Like it's massive. The fact that I'm sitting in this window still just blows my mind. I mean, it's not a very nice view right now. I think that's like, there's some cement there from the pier, <laughs> but yeah this cabin is just so big i will do a cabin tour before i have to move to my permanent cabin just because i think it's fun to see what different cabins are like but my luggage is everywhere so it's not very cute right now for a tour but definitely once i have moved out and i still have a key for here i'll do a quick little tour and also tour my new cabin as well <laughs> like look at this Look at all this space. You could put a whole bed right here. Like someone else could sleep in here. My service isn't quite reaching for my porthole window. So I'm heading to crew deck because I have 15 minutes before I need to be backstage. It's so cool. The crew deck has two jacuzzis. What the heck? It's so good to get fresh air, especially when we spend all day, every day in the theater. We made it to the dressing room. So we're gonna preset our costumes first and then do a physical vocal warm up, mic check, go time. I love it. This is the beautiful area for our quick changes. <laughs> In the little stairwell. Coco's getting her set up. <laughs> Warm up time. amazing to finally be in the full costumes and lights and look out into this gorgeous theater and i love this costume for the finale i feel like i'm in six look at how many layers i'm wearing right now okay so i've got one two three my mic pack and then my tights there's so much holding me in oh my god so I made it back to my cabin, I relaxed for a little bit, and now I am ready to go to dinner. And we're gonna try and go to one of the restaurants on board. We've been going to the Garden Cafe, but we have a lot of time before we're called to rehearsal again. It is now almost 6 p.m., which is early for dinner, but we were very hungry after that show, and we're not called again until 10.15. So we're gonna try and have a nice sit-down dinner. Dinner with my bestie! Yeah. Hi, Mom. Hi. We're enjoying crew deck before we sail away. Oh, oh. <laughs> You're so cute, Dean. That was such a nice evening. And it was so nice just to hang out with my friends and get to know them a bit better and to talk about things other than 
rehearsals and the show and then of course going on crew deck which is always good for the mental health especially during these really long rehearsal days it was getting a bit chilly as we started to sail away so i came back in my cabin i'm gonna take all this makeup off because i have to go to rehearsal in like an hour and a half i think we're just having a note session and cleaning a few things so it shouldn't take too long and tomorrow we open the show I'm so excited just seeing the audience today being in full hair and makeup and costumes and seeing all the seats I'm just gonna be blown away when it's full of people. I haven't performed to this big of an audience in a really long time I'm so excited <sighs> Okay, I'll see you in an hour and a half Kind of wave your hands around. Oh no. Oh. <laughs> it has nothing. Really? Mm -hmm. Is it good? Yeah, no. Sna oh. <laughs> These sandwiches are no. slapping tonight. These are my favorite. <laughs> There's another fried chicken here. <laughs> fried chicken. It's 15 minutes to midnight. I'm ready for bed. But we were productive and it did go by fast. It is still midnight though. But at least tomorrow we don't have to wake up super early. There's just our very first crew drill at 10 a.m. So it's not so bad, but definitely gonna go back to Starbucks. I said I'm going to bed and now there's a party in the hallway. <laughs> morning it has been <laughs> I'm so tired my legs are just like aching I woke up at 5 a.m. as the ship was docking because this cabin is near the front of the ship and it was just rattling like crazy my whole bed was shaking and there was lots of loud noises and then we had our first crew drill and I got lucky today and got chosen to go into a lifeboat so that was really fun and now we have a meeting with hr and then we head into our opening day oh yeah it's opening day today is gonna be really long so i hope i can find the energy from somewhere because right now i could really go back to bed but we have a tech run and then we have two shows tonight which is really exciting because it'll be my first time doing a two show night on cruise ships so i'm really looking forward to it and we are so ready to have an audience cannot wait for that but i'm gonna lay in bed for a few minutes before starting this crazy day yes page work it this work is me it. at the star touch theater hi vlog <laughs> everyone we're about to open our show tonight okay so we just had lunch in the mess and we did our vocal warm-up and now I'm getting my microphone on because we have an hour of sound work on the stage with the band. Then once that's done, we'll do our tech run. Okay, we're ready to go. just got back from rehearsal and I got injured so we were doing the tech run and there's this funk section where the whole cast is on stage there's lots going on lots of pot of berets changing direction and one of the guys 
stomped on my foot with his heel and it hit right where the Leduca buckle is on my foot and it was just like instant shocking pain and then I kind of wobbled off stage <laughs> and then I cried the whole rest of the show backstage with ice on my foot so that's a little scary on opening night yeah I just hate the feeling of not being able to be on stage obviously I need to take care of myself and my body so I'm trying to move my foot figure out if I can do the shows tonight or not it sucks that it's opening night because that's the most exciting one and I've been looking forward to this so much performing on this stage on this ship and I don't want to miss out on that with my whole cast but obviously I need to think about my career and everything so I feel like I can do it it doesn't hurt my actual ankle or like the ball of my foot or anything so that's really good it literally just hurts in this small area where the stomp happened like it's very surface level it's definitely very bruised and swollen <laughs> so it doesn't look great but it doesn't hurt so bad anymore i've been icing it like I've, i was moving and jumping and that all feels totally fine surprisingly thankfully so i told them i'm gonna do it and i will be careful hopefully the adrenaline will numb some of the pain if there is pain but i don't feel like it's the pain isn't in an area where if I danced on it, it would make it worse longevity-wise, if that makes sense. Like, it's not my actual ankle or anything, it's just the surface of my foot, which I feel like the only way to damage that part more, I think, would be if someone stepped on it again, if that makes sense. So, yeah, I'm gonna do as much resting as I can before the show, which I guess we don't really have that much time left because that tech actually took a really long time. So, I don't- someone's calling me. Hello? Wait, can you're on speakerphone because I'm vlogging. I'm asking, it doesn't the mess only open at 4.30? Oh yeah, what time is it? It's only 4. Oh shit. Yeah, so, so I guess we can't eat dinner yet. Yeah, okay. Because uh, I was about to walk down, but I was like, wait a minute. Yeah, I was about to go too. Yeah, so 4.30 then? Yeah, I guess we'll just wait an awkward 30 minutes. Okay. <laughs> see you then. Okay, see you, Ryan. Bye. Bye. <laughs> that was cute. <laughs> I, I should probably do my makeup right now, honestly, and stop crying. But yeah, I am going to try and do the first show. And I'm not going to go crazy, crazy full out, at least with, like, my feet, if that makes sense. Like, obviously, I'm going to rock out the rest of my body. But ugh, it's just so hard to make these decisions in such a time crunch. Because they need to know ASAP because they would have to reblock the show. You know, there's all these things that go into that. So it's like you have to decide your fate. And if you're going <laughs> to try and go on or if it's too much so hopefully i made the right decision and i don't make it worse or anything um but i feel like i just have to go on i have to do the opening i don't know you guys like i've done so much work and i'm finally here to just not go on Ugh, i don't know anyways just thought i'd give you the real authentic live update because this is the life of a performer <laughs> I guess I should start doing my makeup and then go eat food and then basically we have to start resetting our costumes and do the show so <sighs> I'll see you probably backstage okay okay guys we're doing it I feel better it is only painful when I point but I think I can do it dancing queen you guys are opening the show oh. crazy also my foot is feeling better if you're wondering <laughs> I told the vlog I cried on camera she nearly died. I know. It's extreme. But we're here. We're gonna, we're gonna do it. I got lost the other way. I gave up. Where are you guys? Hi. 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 Herself. Yes. My Canadian dance a friend. Well, I'm not so tall, so mine's really long. 
But they're so cute. Yes. So good to wear in between a show. Yeah. Like Keeps to just, your body warm. It's so cozy. Yeah, I know. And I love it with like the makeup. I don't know why it's yeah. like comfy and but glam. You can just take it right off. You don't have to put anything oh, over so your head. It's so easy, yeah. yeah. No, love. But now we're just chilling. There's food outside to eat in between the shows. And then we do it all again. And actually my foot feels good. It doesn't hurt so bad. It's probably from adrenaline. We'll see how I feel tonight, but yay. Ryan's obsessed with cake. I need to have, if you're not gonna have a slice, I'll have your slice. <laughs> you have your slice. Always have my slice. You know where to throw it. <laughs> This Navy is looking for some new recruits. Somebody turn around and shout it when I fucking do a sick on it, boy. Did you see what I just did? Thank you. Thank you. This is real. This is me. I'm exactly where I'm supposed to be now. Gotta let the light shine on me. Now I know who I am. There's no way to hold it in. Disney needs no, no more hiding who I wanna be. This is me. Boy, to hear it's time for it. The reason that I'm singing, I had to find you. I gotta find you. No, we are unhinged. Okay, we need to go to bed. Opened one show, already moving on to the next one. Look at this gorgeous set. You guys, we opened a show! I am just feeling so amazing. I can't even explain. I just feel so good. Like this is where I'm meant to be and this is what I'm meant to do. I'm trying to hold back my tears. I've cried enough today. This has been a wild day. You guys, this morning I was in a lifeboat, okay? And then I hurt my foot and then I did two shows. Oh my gosh. But wow, I am exhausted. Like, so exhausted. But tomorrow morning, we're getting right into our next show, which is parody. I am so excited for that too. I just walked through the theater and they are changing over the set to the parody set. And honestly, you guys, I got chills. I almost cried just like watching them set it up because I am so excited. I'm so happy and I need to get in the shower because they're shutting off all the water in the crew areas at 1am so I gotta get that done before I go to bed but I'm gonna end my vlog here because we opened Band on the Run so thank you so much for watching if you've still stuck around to the end I really appreciate you and I hope you've enjoyed it it's been a wild ride the past few days so if you want to see more of my install process on the Norwegian Star make sure you subscribe of course and leave any questions or comments below I'm so happy to chat with you all I will see you in my next video when we continue install and open another show good night <laughs>